Creating a new graph database using Neo4j in Windows is relatively simple. Once you've installed Neo4j, it's important to remember that Neo4j is designed only to be a single database. However, each graph database is stored in its own directory. So a simple workaround for the fact that you can't currently manage multiple databases in Neo4j is to put each database in its own directory and when you start Neo4j's server, browse to the directory for the database you're interested in. For instance, in my case, I have the default graph database here and then I've created one called TestShake, which I can use if I prefer. So all I would do is select the, the directory for the database I want and click Open. If you want to create a new database that isn't already there, you could browse, find the folder where you want to create the new database, and then create a new folder for that database. So I could create one for IS607, for instance. And then I would click Open, and once I've chosen my database, I click Start. It takes a few seconds for the server to start up, and once the server starts up, I'm ready to browse to the web admin tool. So I'll go to localhost 7474. And you'll see here I'm in the Neo4j browser uh, management tool.